Now, researchers at the University of Warwick say an invasive species of hornet from the Far East could colonise the UK in just two decades. The Asian hornet could have a big impact on native honeybees. They wait outside beehives, catch and eat honeybees as they return home. Our science correspondent David Gregory Kumar is here with more. David, clearly not a great time to be a honeybee. Not really, Mary, no. This is an Asian hornet here, and as you said, they lurk outside uh, bee hives. This behaviour is called hawking. They hover in front and catch the honeybees as they're on their way, their way back, snip off the heads and eat them. It is quite bad for our, for our honeybee populations. The European honeybee has no natural defensive strategy against Asian hornets. Um, they're unlikely to be wiped out completely, uh, but it adds to a growing number of threats to honeybees and pollinators, um, along with other pests, disease, um, and things like pesticides. And this is an Asian hornet nest, one of the first to be found in the UK. It was discovered in Gloucestershire. It's about the size of a really big pumpkin. This one was destroyed. Dr Franklin is part of a team at the University of Warwick and they've used a computer to model how Asian hornets might spread, starting in Gloucestershire and then moving out until eventually, in around 20 years, according to the model, they'll have colonised the entire UK. But we can help prevent this. Uh, we're quite well prepared to try and combat uh, a growing population of Asian hornets and uh, accurate reports on where they are would be key to doing that uh, effectively. Well, to help with that reporting, you can use a smartphone app. You can even build traps for the Asian hornet, as demonstrated here in a government video, especially useful for beekeepers. And importantly, the Asian hornet isn't dangerous to humans. Its sting is similar to a wasp, but it is very dangerous to our honeybees. And on the blog, there's a link to all this information if you want to help repel the invaders at bbc.co.uk slash David Gregory Kumar. Mary. Thanks for that, David. I will take a look. Yeah, not great news for bees, is it? Thank you.